Yo, yeah, what's up, guys? This is Curse Pike. My friends call me Big C. Back in action today, we're continuing our video editing series where I teach you how to be the best video editor you know. And not only that, you're going to learn how to do it for free. So if you're a video editor and you're just getting started or you're even thinking about getting started and you don't know where to start, you think it might be too hard, I'm here to tell you, no problem, I got you covered. In this video, I'm going to show you how to do a black and white sequence from a color video. Why would I show you this? Very simple. One of the things that YouTube really rewards is attention span. People watching your videos and staying watching. When people click your video or they end your video or they click off of it, that sends a negative signal to YouTube. So one way that you can do that is by adding in all sorts of cool things like motion graphics, changing colors, transitions, different things like that. And if you watch some of the big YouTubers, they do that. Mr. Beast always has something popping in for attention span every few seconds just to keep your eyes going. And one of the things I'm going to show you, like I said, is the black and white color to black and white. So how do we do it? Really, really simple here. I've got, a, I've got two videos in my timeline. I've got a bulldog doing bulldog things, and then I've got a puppy dog dreaming, okay? So what do we got? I'm going to go ahead and make it so that, let's go ahead and move this bulldog to the end of that. So we've got the dogs dreaming. What's the dog dreaming about? Well, he's dreaming about his friend, the bulldog. Good looking boys, both of them. So I'm just going to move this to the front here, and what we're going to do is we're going to make this dog, this dream sequence, it's going to go kind of neo film noir style black and white and we're gonna make this bulldog black and white so how do we do that real simple you wanna go to your media and then switch over to your effects panel and when you open up your effects panel you're gonna see a whole bunch of stuff so you'll see this here you wanna go down to color correction you would think that it might be under color grading but this is actually a correction and then what you wanna do is you wanna go all the way down to hue saturation and lightness I'm going to left click on this. You're going to notice that there's no orange button here, which means it's a free effect. So I'm going to drag and drop that on top of the bulldog, just like that. And presto, it does nothing. Do not panic. You'll see here under controls now that under effects that hue, saturation, and lightness has a check mark. And now we're going to go ahead and make it black and white. Let's go ahead and do it. What you want to do, real simple, go to the master, click on that little triangle, chevron, and then all you need to do is just drop the saturation to minus 100. When you do that, that's it. Now your video is black and white. So that's all there is to it. So in this case, you'll have a, you'll have the dog dreaming. What's the dog dreaming? The dog's doing a dream sequence. And because it's a dream, the dream sequence is in black and white. That's an incredibly easy to use production value enhancing technique that will help you out. We'll be doing a video shortly where I string them all together. So you're going to see motion graphics, transitions, color transitions, black and white, all sorts of flying and floating and all that other stuff that you see in all these other high-end videos. I'm going to show you how to do all of it. But this one, black and white. Thanks for watching, guys. ton more stuff coming up. Stay tuned. I'll be back soon.